Good morning. I wanted to share with you something today that is not exactly from my garden, but is about my garden. Something that I bought for my garden. <laughs> and here's the story. Two years ago, my husband and I took a luxury barge cruise from Bruges to Amsterdam. And along the way, we stopped in Delft. And Delft is a city that is known for this beautiful China, this beautiful blue and white China. It's a beautiful city in and of itself. And as you know, there's tulips everywhere. We saw fields of tulips and um, tulips in vases and tulips in baskets and just everywhere. And it was just so, so gorgeous. So I decided when we went to the Delft factory, which if you ever go, you must visit the Delft factory, uh, that I had to have something for my garden, uh, for the tulips. Now, of course, there are no tulips in my garden right now, but I bought this beautiful vase. It's called a tulipier, and they come in all different sizes. This one is quite small, and um, it has one, two, three, four, seven apertures for tulips. Now, initially, tulips would have been grown in here. They would have been like forest bulbs that grew in here so you could grow them uh, during off-season times. But uh, today, really, we just put tulips in them. And, you know, tulipiers can be, oh gosh, they can be five feet tall, looking like pagodas. I'm going to try to insert a photo of the one that I wanted to buy, but it was like $50,000, so we didn't buy that one. <laughs> Anyways, I really enjoy this. It's on my kitchen table all the time, and um, it holds all kinds of different flowers, but in the spring, I put tulips in it. Let me tell you more about a little bit more about the Delft pottery. It's just stunning. Uh, I bought this very, very beautiful sort of decorative plate. And uh, Delft pottery actually has been around since the 1600s. It was inspired by Chinese porcelain. And um, the factory was started, bought by Juiced Thuft. Juiced Thuft. <laughs> And so the way that you know that you have authentic Delft China is if you see this particular marking on the back. It says Delft, but you can see the J, T, and the little pot at the top. So that means that it's hand-painted um, Delft pottery. Now, some of these other smaller pieces, I, I got this beautiful little <clears throat> tea, tea bag holder. Uh, it says hand-painted. Delft Holland. So that's not the high end. That's sort of a mass produced piece. And these I got off of eBay just because I loved them and I want, I had to have them. And you can see this is also a, um, an original Delft piece because it has the same marking as on the back of this beautiful plate. So Holland, uh, Amsterdam, you know, as you know, famous for their tulips and their flowers. We visited so many beautiful places there. I'm going to look in these catalogs and buy some spring bulbs. And when my tu when tulips are not in the tulipier, I have these beautiful little wooden tulips that I bought in Amsterdam. And I put those in there and they're a lovely pop of color against the blue. So um, tulip fever, as they call it, or um, tulip mania was an actual phenomena that happened in Holland in uh, the 1600s where tulip bulbs were being sort of like traded on the stock market. And one tulip bulb at one point went for 12 acres of land. Somebody paid 12 acres of land for one tulip bulb. And um, one tulip bulb could also actually cost the salary of a middle-class person. So they were really something that only the elite were able to afford. They were stolen from gardens and people had very elaborate um, signals so that people wouldn't steal from the gardens. They had bells, bells uh, rigged up in the gardens so that they wouldn't be stolen. And um, it was a market that eventually crashed 
and I think caused great consternation in Holland. But at any rate, it's a very interesting phenomena, and there is a novel a, that's not about it, it's a fictionalized account around it, called Tulip Fever, um, and the author is Deborah Mogach. So if you're interested in reading about that, that's also um, something fun for you to think about. So just a little bit of interest about our journeys uh, to Delft and the beautiful Delft Tulipier for all of my tulips in the spring. <laughs>